Hi, I'm Officer Carr with the Fredericksburg Police Department. We have received a lot of questions in reference to what to expect during a vehicle stop, so we decided to make a video on exactly that. Please note that we are required to activate our body-worn camera while we interact with the public during enforcement actions. Now here's what to expect while being pulled over by an officer in the city of Fredericksburg. When an officer is going to initiate a vehicle stop, they typically don't activate their emergency equipment immediately. They're looking for a place to stop where it is safe for you as well as the officer. While required to move over, vehicles on the roadway may not, so we hope for you to pull as far to the right as possible, be it the shoulder or into a parking lot. Also, prior to activating their emergency equipment, the officer will transmit information over the radio to the emergency communication center. If for some reason you feel uncomfortable with the location, please turn on your emergency hazard lights. This could show the officer that you acknowledge the stop and intend to pull over as soon as possible. For everyone's safety, officers like to see as little movement as possible in a vehicle. When an officer approaches your vehicle, please keep your hands on the steering wheel. We understand that you might be looking for your information, such as your license or vehicle registration. Please wait to retrieve these items until directed to do so. If you are registered to carry a concealed weapon, we understand that you may have that weapon on your person or in your vehicle. Please inform the officer immediately that you have the concealed weapon and where it is located. Do not reach for the weapon at any point during the traffic stop. If you are issued a ticket, you will be asked to sign it. This is not an admission of guilt. Your signature is just to show that you will attend court as required by law and know when and where to appear. For many traffic tickets, you can prepay the fine before the court date to be excused from attending court. If you have questions during the vehicle stop, feel free to ask the officer. If you feel as though the officer violated your rights or policy, the time to make the complaint is after the stop. A complaint can be filed in person, online, or over the phone. Once the complaint is made, a supervisor will review the body-worn camera footage and investigate. So to recap, we may follow you a few miles because we're looking for a safe place to initiate the stop and transmitting information over the radio. Please keep your hands visible. The steering wheel is the best place. Please advise us immediately if there's a weapon in the vehicle. If necessary, make a complaint after the vehicle stop. Complaints can be filed online, in person, or over the phone. We get that no one wants to be pulled over or to get a ticket. It makes for a bad day. However, we are required to enforce the laws, traffic violations being part of that, to ensure the roadways remain safe for everyone. We hope this video answered some of the questions posed by our community on what to expect during a vehicle stop. Thanks for watching.